hello guys welcome back to my channel cheat it here i think this is a good time to tell you guys my friends call me juju so you can call me juju cool right so this video is going to be a 10 minute everyday makeup tutorials for school for work this video is for people who don't have time in the morning you want to look good in the morning but then you don't want to look like you just got off the bed wore your clothes and start coming out i got you you have me and i got you so just stay tuned and enjoy I'm going to be starting off with the CeraVe Moisturizer. I recommend you moisturize your skin. Moisturizer is really, really important for all skin type. The next stuff I'll be going in with this primer from Rimmel London. It says steamer, but I consider this a silicone primer. So prime your skin if you have an oily skin. Like myself, I have really oily skin and you have to prime your skin i use this primer because i feel like it's lightweight and it helps my foundation just sit then i'll be going in with this l'oreal foundation in n7 i apply this with my beauty sponge because you know there is no time so you don't have time to start doing bringing out your brush doing this doing that and also i just apply this directly to my skin with my beauty sponge even though there is no time you have to blend your makeup yes girl you have to blend your makeup because you don't want to look like you have mud on your face so make sure your makeup is well blended just blend like your life depends on it very very important so we are done blending now we're going in with the younger beauty concealer to highlight under my skin this is not really really light so it's not going to like overly highlight my skin i'm going for a very soft look so i'm just going to use this concealer to highlight my skin blend that in properly with, with the same beauty sponge there is no time to start sorting out this sorting out that but i recommend you have your product lined up on your table already this way it's going to save time or like get it ready a day before this way it's going to save you a lot of time and a lot of stress so i just blend this on my t-zone i applied under my eyes blend on my temple under my nose my chin and the bridge of my nose then i'm going in with this having good powder palette to contour my skin this is actually very very easy to use i mean the powder contour is actually very easy to apply so i just apply that with a brush on my skin I'm using the same powder to contour my nose area so after contouring my nose area to my satisfaction i'll be going in with the powder all over my face same hair having good powder but this time i'll be using my powder shade all over my face i won't be using the contour shade so this is the shade i'll be using all over my face because this is my powder shade i'm going to mix into the boots powder i just showed you in this video because this way it helps me to achieve like my exact powder shade so i'm going to be using a powder brush this brush is from flawless ivy i love their brushes a lot just use this to apply the powder all over my face then i'll be going in with my blush this is this blush is from classic so i just apply that on my cheek like blush my cheek so i don't look pale even though i'm brushing i have to attend to something and it's early i have to get my makeup done and get going i need not to look pale i need not to look like a mod so i just have to blush my face give it some colors you know what i'm talking about next i'll be going in with my laura messier's translucent powder under my eyes to set under my eyes i apply this with a brush this way it just make my under eye look flawless and lightweight next step because there is no time to start doing eyeshadow so i just have to like add color on my eyelid i use my powder 
this powder i use is from the same palette the same powder palette i've been using in the video i just use a darker shade just to apply that on my eyelid area to make it look like i have eyeshadow on but very very light this can also work as your eyeshadow if you're doing an actual eyeshadow so this can work as well Next, I'm going to be lining my brows with this Davies Brow Pencil in number 3. I brush my brows upwards with my spoolie and just try to fill that in. I'm not going to conceal my brows in this video because I have full brows so I just try to fill that in. But if your brows are tiny, you can like try to do them before your makeup. I have like a detailed brow tutorial where you can learn how to do your brows yourself and how to do your brows on somebody it's a very detailed tutorial so just go watch i'm going to leave the link in the description box so because i have full brows i'm just trying to fill that in but if you don't if your brows are not as full as mine so try to do it before your skin work So I'm not going to be using false lashes, so I'm going to use this Zaron mascara to add volume to my lashes. This mascara is a must have. I love it so much because it just gives me that volume I want and I'm good to go. For my lip, I'm going to have almost nothing on my lip using my favorite eye magic cream lip palette on my lips so i'm just going to apply this nude on my lip and just like try to smack it because i don't want to have so much on my on my lip i'm trying to go for a very soft look because it's as if i'm going to walk or i'm going to school so i want to look really really soft and flawless and glammed and beautiful so i'm just going to have little quantity on my lip and apply my gloss on it and i am good to go When I'm done doing my lip, I just use my small powder brush to like dust out the excess setting powder under my eyes and try to blend my face before going in with my setting spray. Now I'm going with this Maybelline Master Fix Setting Spray. This is a matte spray, not really really dry, but it just give me that tries to give me that matte finish. So I just spray that on my face and go in with my mascara under my eyes to add volume to my lower lashes so next step i'll be going glowing my face with this inglot cosmetic highlighter so i just took little quantity i'm not a highlighter girl so i just took little quantity applied on my face to you know pop my face a little yeah because i'm going to conquer my day to have to pop my face a little and try to blind my enemies with the glow guys while we are these subscribe to my channel please subscribe to my channel please subscribe to my channel and we have come to the end of this video i hope you enjoy this video someone on this channel actually requested i do this look and i'm loving it so much i hope you enjoyed this video please give this video a very big thumbs up if you like it drop a comment for me down below what you think about this video if this video was helpful and insightful please let me know is there any comments any content sorry you would like to see on this channel please leave it in the comment section and i promise to come true subscribe to my channel if you're yet to turn on the post notification bell so you know when i post new amazing videos like this and i will see you guys in my next video 
thank you so much for watching i love you guys bye